Hello friends, welcome to risingpearl.com. Today we are talking about series 13 where we are learning a great deal on surface areas and volumes. This is episode number 4 and today we are going to find out how to calculate volume of a right circular cylinder. Now, volume of any object, regardless of the, the shape and the dimension, volume of any object, generally speaking, is the amount of space which is occupied by the object. So that is what is meant by volume of an object. Now this is mostly true if the object is a solid object. But what if, if the object is hollow, meaning it is empty from inside? In that case, one other way to define the volume of the object is, if the object is hollow, then object can be filled with gas, any kind of gas, maybe air or any other liquid. Because the inside is empty, we can fill it in with any form of gas, air or anything like that, or we can fill it up with any kind of liquid. So in, in such cases, the volume of the object can be expressed in terms of how much substance, whether it is a liquid or a gas, we can fill into the object. So this is also referred to as the capacity of an object. So, in other words, if you have any solid object, then the volume of that object is the amount of space that the object occupies. If the object is hollow from inside, one other way to think about volume is the amount of either any kind of gas or liquid you can fill in. So, how much can you actually put in also is the volume of that object and that is also referred to as the capacity. So just to quickly sum up, volume of an object is the amount of space the object occupies and the capacity of an object, you, you may come across this term quite a bit, capacity of an object is the volume of substance the object can hold or accommodate. So now that said, let's draw ourselves a right circular cylinder. We know that the two most important dimensions of any right circular cylinder, they are the radius of the top and the bottom circle because they both are same and the height of the right circular cylinder right so the volume of any right circular cylinder would be simply you calculate the area of either the top circle or the bottom circle right which is highlighted in blue here and simply multiply that times the height in other words, in other words, so this is the area of the top or the bottom circle. So if, if this area highlighted in blue is pi r squared, simply multiply that by the third dimension which is the height. So pi r squared times h or pi r squared h, this is the formula for calculating volume of any right circular cylinder. 